fascinating. Sea stars and snails and red rock crabs. Red rock crabs don't live in this part of the ocean. It's too cold for them. I wonder how they got here. Hello, I'm Shellington. I'm an octopus. Stay back. <gasps> oh. Oh, impressive. I knew red rock crabs were quick, but I didn't realize they were that quick. There's no need to be frightened. I just want to... This way, Chokes! I'm here to help. You'll never catch us! Hey. Yeah. Through his legs, Chokes! <laughs> just can't stand this place. It's cold, there's nothing to eat, and now some big furry thing's chasing after us! Captain! Come in, Captain! Shellington, how are you getting on exploring that island? Well, Captain, there's a bit of a mystery. I found some red rock crabs, but they don't belong here. This island is much too cold for them, and there's not enough food. They won't last long here. I'm going to need help rounding them up and taking them back where they belong. Understood. Dashy, sound the Octo Alert. Octonauts, to the launch bay. We've got a problem with some red rock crabs on an island where they don't belong. I don't know how they got here, but we need to take them back to their home in the Galapagos Islands. The Galapagos are a long way from here. Can we just load them into the garbs? No, that's the tricky part. They're very hard to catch. Every time I try to get close, they run away. Shellington, we're on our way. All right, everyone, let's take this nice and easy. These crabs are a long way from home, and they're probably a bit scared. Hey, up. It's another of those furry things. Don't worry, little crabs. It's time to come with me. Aha! I'm Peso, and I'm soaking wet. I, I forgot to tell you, Peso. They squirt water when they feel threatened. Leave us alone. Oh! I'll get my brother onto you. I get away. Oh. Captain, we've been trying to catch the crabs all evening, and we haven't caught a single one. Aye, these little mateys are quicker than I thought. It's getting dark. We'll have to try again tomorrow with the whole crew. Good morning, Octonauts. Everyone ready for a bit of crab catching? Aye, aye, yes, Captain. We'll round them up faster and you can see a bunch of munchy, crunchy carrots. Remember, these crabs are extra fast, so we'll need to be quick. Got it? Got, Got it. it. This could take a while, so if you need a break, Tunip and the Vegemals have set up a seaweed snack station. Super, super. Super. Octonauts, let's do this. Sounds like Tunip. Tunip, is everything all right? Shiver me whiskers. It's the marine iguanas. <laughs> Octonauts. Funny running into you here. Yeah, imagine that. Piggy, <laughs> Ted, Sneezy, aren't you a little far from home? Ooh, not a little, a long way from home. First, red rock crabs, and now marine iguanas. How did all these creatures from the Galapagos end up here? Go on, tell him, Iggy. Shush, I was just about to. It all started with a wild storm. The winds were so strong, they swept us right out to sea. 
Luckily for us, we was able to grab onto a clump of floating kelp. We used this kelp as a life raft. And a snack. We drifted for days, and our kelp raft was getting smaller. Well, I was hungry. <laughs> Till eventually, we was washed up here onto this little island. Ah, and so the red rock crabs must have been carried here on kelp rafts too. That's incredible. No, it's terrible. The water here's too cold for us to die for seaweed to eat. That's why we've been uh, borrowing your little snacks. Don't worry, iguanas. We'll take you and the crabs back home. Just as soon as we can round them up. <laughs> you never catch red rock crabs like that. Ah, I think you're right. If only we had something to distract them so we could sneak up on them. Captain, I think I know just the thing. Now what do we do? Just pretend you're sunbathing. I'm <laughs> so. Shh! Here they come. Now there's a sight for sore eyes. Three iguanas ready for cleaning. Hey, Chuck, so hungry. Red rock crabs love to climb on marine iguanas and eat the gunk off their backs. That way, both of them benefit. One gets fed, the other one gets cleaned. I believe that's what's called symbiosis. <laughs> yes, that's right. Watch. <laughs> oh, they're kind of tickles. All right, everyone. Now that they're distracted... <gasps> it's those furry guys again. Octonauts, stay in formation. Run for your lives! They'll see. Well, what are we waiting for? No, Quasi. It's too dangerous. Not for a marine iguana. Our claws give us special grip. Watch. If only we had claws like that. Let me see those claws again. Knock yourself out. Mm. You know what, Peso? I think I might be able to make a song. Tweak, these are a great invention. Thanks, Cap. I call them climbing claws. Everyone stay close and follow me. We need to herd the crabs up to the top of the cliff. We're ready for them, Captain. They'll be safe in here. <laughs> <laughs> it's working, Captain. Just a little further. Steady. Keep moving forward, Octonauts. Doing to my friends. Don't worry. We just want to take you back to your home. Take us back home? Well, why didn't you say so? Uh, why'd you hitch a ride? Don't mind if I do. Ah, oh, good. Ah, <laughs> two! Oh, no! Ah, oh, Help! Octonauts, form a chain. Aye, aye, Captain. <laughs> Let's bring them in. Good work, everyone. Thanks for helping us, Chuck. We was just a bit scared before, being so far from home. No problem. But we couldn't have done it without the iguanas. Oh, don't mention it. Now, what do you say we go home? I say, let's go, Chucks. Octomort to the Galapagos. Here we are, the Galapagos Islands. Hey, everybody, we're home. And just in time, too. I could really do with a snack. Me too. Come on. <laughs> Oh, that's nice.